Hey Aries, it's Sunny, and this is your weekly for the week of August 3rd, 2015. So if you would like a reading from me, the link is always in the description box below. And after each video, I always have a picture stating where my website is. So obviously this is a general reading, and I may not touch bases on your situation. So if you would like a reading from me, just check me out. My website is below, and you can see if we mesh, okay? Um... But I'm still doing these two extended videos for the two zodiac signs who receives the most liked and viewed video. So the zodiac sign who receives the most liked, I'm going to talk about your career, your love life, and or your finances. And for the zodiac sign who receives the most viewed video, I'm going to talk about um, a detailed weekly, honey. I talk too fast because I just want to rush this this intro, okay? <laughs> but I'm talking about a detailed weekly involving the beginning mid and end of the week so um yeah and i will post those every friday or saturday all right but i'm trying to think if i had any visions for you guys my areas did i have any visions for you guys um no i don't think i did um but the vibe that i got from it was just like um don't be too cocky humble yourself please and my car is telling me the same thing I am picking up that there may be some sort of delays involving your career life. Um, be careful of your temper. Mostly is what I'm picking up. Be careful of your temper. Be careful of fighting people off. Be careful of, you know, back talking. Whatever the case may be. Like And also, like like I said earlier, like be careful of your um, cockiness. Like be humble. Like if you receive some sort of a reward or some sort of praise, you know, say thank you. Or, you know, like just say uh i appreciate it but like thank you too for like giving me this opportunity and thank you for my teammates for you know being there for me and cheering me on like don't be like yeah i know i deserve it i needed it like don't don't because it's really gonna cause like a, a lot of delays for you and your boss and our manager or supervisor is just gonna look at you like that's a cocky ass motherfucker like we should have never given him or her that reward so be mindful about that if not like i said just be careful of um your expression of self and just don't fight things off like if people want to help you or like if you need help just allow for it to happen i'm not gonna lie i am picking up on like a lot of delays for you guys this week i am especially involving career and money um i am picking up that there's going to be some delays of some and some sort of heartbreak uh with your power so just don't abuse your power don't abuse um your your position within life and within your career like whatever position that you play and you feel like you may be on your high horse like that can be taken away from you just like that especially like if you are cocky and you're picking up some sort of heartbreak uh, within any deep rooted and spiritual connections that you share with other people so a lot of you like you may go through a sort of breakup even if the relationship was like very strong and powerful like some of you like you may just cut ties with uh your partner because it's just going to uh, I feel like a lot of powerless feelings between you and your partner and maybe some lessons learned um, especially if you are in, uh, tied into a Virgo or an air sign person air signs are maybe a water sign as well um, air signs are Aquarius, Gemini, and Libra or this water sign who has gone cold and like they're really shut down and they're not really telling you how they feel anymore water signs are pisces cancer and scorpio because I, I kept saying pisces start with pisces so yeah so you know just be careful about that i mean it is what it is i'm also picking up on deaths so this may be signing into like death of a, of a relationship or maybe death well, within family i am picking up threesome parties so you may, maybe your partner will find out that you were doing other things behind their back. Or you may find out that your partner was doing things behind your back. Whatever the case may be. However, if you are single, I do feel like casual dating will not be good for you. Some of you, I am picking up on a, um, an earth sign person. I do feel like the relationship between you and this earth sign person, there needs to be some sort of healing. Other people was involved. It was basically sex. But you guys had good potential to grow. You were in this earth sign person, earth signs are Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo. But the, the relationship was just based on physicality and like a, attraction, like sexual attraction. So it is going to be really, 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 really weird. So honestly, love will not be, you know, really positive for you guys this week. I'm, I hate to say that. 
um, I am picking up on some disappointments and maybe some re some regrets involving your work life and or your finances. Be careful that you aren't spending too much or that you haven't spent too much, um, Aries. Um, I am picking up that some of you, like you were looking for this sort of promotion or this sort of raise. Um, but there was some sort of holdout. Like someone was just basically like giving you the runaround or maybe, um, you were given a promotion and or a raise, but it's not what you thought it would have been. You know, like you, you just, you just feel like, oh my God, I thought, you know, this new position was going to be better for me. I thought I was going to be more happier in this position. So, you know, just be mindful of that coming to play. I am uh, seeing that some of you, like you are going to be too much into your head involving certain situations. Um, I am seeing that gossip will play a really big part. If not, you may be too much to see ahead involving an air sign person. Maybe an Aquarius, because I'm picking up on the Aquarius energy. Or maybe someone who's like a social butterfly. And um, they're kind of playerish. Or they give off the vibe that they're really independent and that they really don't need anyone. Like they kind of go back and forth with their emotions sometimes. And it's really hurting you. You know, you, you really don't know what to do. You're thinking too much in it. It's like you want things to be perfect and you want things to be good. But, I mean, I do feel like this is a karmic relationship. And there's something that you need to learn from this relationship in order for your uh, souls to no longer meet again. Because with karmic relationships, the sucky thing about it is if you don't properly cut ties or learn the lesson that you need to learn with your um previous soulmate your souls are going to keep uh coming together coming back together and you're going to go through the same thing just different souls all over well different uh body images all over again so learn the lesson that you need to learn especially if you feel as if this person is like really connected to you you feel as if you've known this person for a long time you guys can read each other's minds like really find out what it is that you need to learn from this person in order for your soul to no longer feel this heartbreak again all right but the message of this week for you guys move on from your past be a better person the vibe that i'm picking up is, is like be a better person control your inner animal control your inner demons control your inner feistiness like just be a better person be the person who you want to become and look back and say dang i really grew up or i really matured you know um we are in leo season so and this is a representation of leo so leo season is a really good time for you guys to become the person who you want to become and control the person who you once were or who you are right now all right and be something for the better i'm also picking up that some of you like you may be tied into a fire sign uh or you may have like a leo on your mind um this may be their sun or their rising or their moon sign. Whatever the case may be. Um, yeah, you... Then This Leo person, they may help you with that. They may help you move forward. And they may help you, like, pretty much... Oh, my God, card, get off my elbow. Yeah, they may help you to tame that inner animal within you. Um, if not this Leo person, you. Like I said, we are in Leo season. And it's a really good time for you guys to... Um, be a better person all right so please do that try to have a good week this week my aries and i'll see you guys next week bye